often? Once a week, once a month? Oh, once in a while? Once in a while. Once in a while. So not a regular thing? Huh? Not a regular thing at all. Beer doesn't do that to you, do it? No, no. no. <laughs> Thanks, gotcha. goodness. Yeah. How about your body weight? Has that changed? Um, it hasn't weight? changed. I'd like to change it. I'd like to lose some weight. What, but what, are, you, what are you weighing now? I weigh about 200. 200, huh? Have you, has your weight changed since the accident? No. So this headache hasn't taken away your appetite or your ability to eat or anything? That no. I, well, you know, I don't think I eat as heartily as I used mm -hmm. to, just because when you have a bad headache, it's, mm -hmm. you're not really thinking about eating. Sure. I don't notice that I've lost any weight because of that. So as far as you know, your weight's about the same about as it was the same, three months yeah. ago. Gotcha. Do, I, also, it would be helpful for me to know your physical activity level. Tell me, Not your, much. tell me about your job first. Not is your job much. a desk job or are you on your feet? Um, I'm on my feet behind a desk and I'm actually sometimes I pitch in and help mm -hmm. turn wrenches. Mm -hmm. um, Most or at the time, some of the time or just on occasion? Just on occasion. Mm -hmm. So it's I, mostly a sitting job then? Huh? Yes. You know, either standing or sitting behind a mm -hmm. desk. Um, mm -hmm. Service manager, you bring your car into me and gotcha. we mm -hmm. document what's wrong with it and mm -hmm. do some paperwork. and. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Get your car fixed, and gotcha. that's pretty much. So not a lot of no no sweat level activity. No, not really. What do you do that makes you sweat? Yard work. I don't How often? do um, as little as possible. Hmm. I rake the leaves. I cut the grass. Mm -hmm. um, Is that a weekly thing? A monthly thing? Well, in the summer, springtime, you know, I'm mm -hmm. cutting the grass weekly, mm -hmm. and you know the leaves are getting ready to fall, so I'll be raking leaves. So it depends a little bit on the weather and the circumstances. Correct. But you don't have a regular get out every day for half an hour and do something? No, I don't. Gotcha. Is that not your love? No, it's not. I never was an exerciser. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, gotcha. so. What would you weigh in high school, by the way? Just give me a little sense. Of um, I probably weighed about 165. 160. So you're about a good 35 pounds. Yeah. Well, what do you consider your preferred weight? I'd like to be about 180. 180, huh? 185. Yeah. I always like to ask people that. It mm -hmm. tells you where they are compared to where they'd like to be. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, how about your gut? Appetite? Um, when I'm not in a severe headache, my appetite is fine. Can you eat anything? Pretty much so. Ever have any abdominal kind of symptoms from eating? Mm, no, not Or from really. not eating? No. Stomach my wife hurt. cooks what she calls a heart-healthy diet. Hmm. You know, mm -hmm. I eat a lot of fiber in the morning, mm -hmm. cereal, skim milk. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, we so your wife's the designer for the most part? Of pretty it. much so. It sounds like it's healthy from what you Yeah, Yes, she, anyway. she really is pretty aware gotcha. of that. Tell me, uh, any, any difficulty with your bowel activity? No, pretty regular. How often do you go? Twice a day. Twice a day. Is that your, that's your standard that's, thing, that's huh? Right, yeah. Formed? Loose? Um, or don't even think about it? Don't even think about it. Not, not diarrhea. But no changes? But no changes. Okay. But, and you've been that way for, that's been your, that's been that's, your, your habit. Yeah, it's always now. been like that. Gotcha. Uh, how about what I call your plumbing? Urinary ha mm -hmm. habit? Ever notice anything that doesn't seem right to you? Um, no, I've, I think mm -hmm. I pee about the same as I always have. Do you get up at night to empty your bladder? One time a night. Just one time. Yep. How long has that been the case? Oh, a couple of years now, I guess. A couple of years. Yeah. Huh? So it did change. It, yeah, it did change. From younger years. Right. I, I never used it to get up. Once. Gotcha. Yeah. It's but not you, every night, but mm -hmm. it's... Oh, okay. So, so you still have an online capacity, but it changes depending right. on Right. Yeah. 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 Gotcha. Um, any trouble with nature, your nature? No. You know what I mean by your nature? I'm not sure, I think. That's a man's ability to get an erection. Yeah, no No. No troubles no with that? Problems. Gotcha. Uh, tell me more about your muscles, bones, joints. You've had trouble with your knees and they're better. Mm -hmm. Do you have other arthritic symptoms like shoulder pain, like hand pain, like foot pain, um, like your mother had? Anything like that? The base of my thumb. If I if I pitch in and help the guys if hmm. we're fixing a car, mm -hmm. if my if I'm doing more mechanical work, mm -hmm. I, I feel like in the base of my thumb it gets. Um, mm. I don't know if it's arthritic or just muscular. But right there where you're pointing right, to. Right, right there where I'm pointing yeah, to. Yeah. Um, and if I have to get on my knees for anything, mm -hmm. um, if I spend any time on my knees, my knees mm. will hurt. So you don't mind going down on those new knees, huh? I prefer not to. I want to make mm -hmm. them last. Yeah, um, yeah. But at times I don't but have at a time choice. That's a problem, yeah. Yeah. And are you right-handed? I am right-handed. So is this the hand you might use if you're going to use a wrench or something? It, like it would be, yes. Gotcha. Other joints bother you? No. No. Not really. Were you going to say something? 
Um, also, the hand, the arm that I broke. I don't know if there's any mm. correlation between mm. that pain and the arm. Do you hurt up where the fracture was, or just more down by the base of the thumb? Um, more in my wrist than anything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I can turn this arm all the way over, mm -hmm. and this arm I can only turn that mm -hmm. far. And they told me it's just that the bones were so badly shattered mm -hmm. that the way they had to line them up, mm -hmm. that it's never perfect again. And if it's off a little bit here, it'll be oh, off a little bit up here. So they alerted you to expect yeah, some palm up was going to be yeah, a little some bit limited. decreased range of motion. Is that getting better with time? Um, Do I don't think so. Don't think so. Yeah. so it's kind of fixed. I, I'm I'm used to it now. Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah, uh -huh. gotcha. Uh, so you smoke for 22 years. Do you have any trouble with your lungs? Breathing? No. Cough? No. Okay. I mean, the occasional cold. Do you have stairs in your house? Yes. Do you walk them regular? Yes. Can you do them all at once, or do you have to stop along the I way? I do them all at once. Do they make you short of breath at all? Um, they don't make me short of breath, but I'm glad when I get to the top. Uh-huh. Yeah. So you notice some change. Is that any different now than it was a year ago? Um, no, I wouldn't say, say that. Nothing like that, huh? Gotcha. It may be different than 10 years ago. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. What do you know about your heart's activity? Ever know, have been told you had any trouble? Other than the high blood pressure, mm -hmm. no. Right. Have you had any heart checks related to the, your seeing your doctor and your high blood pressure, stress mm -hmm. tests or no things like that? No. So, and when you go up those stairs, do you ever feel any pain in your chest? No. In fact, do you ever feel with anything, even with sexual activity? No. no. So things work for you. Yeah, no, no limitations yeah, come from that not, area. Not that I know. Of. Yeah. Um, and short sure, windedness wouldn't grab you if you were lying down for a long period of time or. If, I'm sorry. If you're lying down, do you ever get short of breath just lying down? Oh, no. Nothing like that? No. How far can you walk? Um, if you and I went walking on casually, how far could you go? Well, with my knees, even though they're, they're mm -hmm. good, mm -hmm. uh, I'm still somewhat limited. I could probably walk a couple miles. You could? Yeah, I think okay. so. Do you see any changes in the past year or two on that? Uh, I think they're getting better. Oh, getting better? I, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the knees, yeah, so they're still... There's a long healing. recovery. Yep, 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 that's yep, good. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's see, other things. Ever have any trouble with things like anemia? No. Low blood counts, things like that? No. Are you aware of whether you ever had trouble with your blood sugar? Or? Not that I know of. How I, about your cholesterol? Have you ever, I'm sure you've had that checked, haven't you? Yeah, I have that checked. Um, the last time I had it checked... It was within the normal range. I don't remember oh, exactly what it was. So no medications involved? No. This is, mm -hmm. Gotcha. Okay. Covering a lot, huh? Yeah, definitely so. Do we miss anything so far? Not yet. More than I thought. Mm -hmm. Well, we like to be sure we know as much about you. Mm -hmm. So we can think about other things going on here. Okay, your heart, your lungs, your gut, your kidneys. We talked about that some. Mm -hmm. Your joints. Your, all your... And then, in terms of your nervous system, ever have any problems with that? Ever have any weakness or tingling um, anywhere? I asked about your arms, yeah. how about your legs? Maybe when I'm turning wrenches, mm -hmm. I'll get a little tingling mm. in my hand, mm -hmm. which I always thought was just from whatever's right here at the base of the thumb. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But other than that, and it, and it doesn't last. It doesn't last. No, yeah. once I stop yeah. doing that. There is, there is a nerve there that you can is it? compress when you're. Especially if your hands aren't toughened from regular practice, uh -huh. you can get a little bit of a what's called median nerve tingle. Okay. Does that ever come on by itself? No. Or do you have to be wrenching? To do I, I have to be doing something for it. Do you have good so. grip strength? Yeah, I think so. So that's not that no. at all either then. Okay. Well, I think we got pretty much everything. Unless there's something else you can think of. I'm trying to think. Um, no, I'm, you, you've asked me more than what I, what I thought. Good, yeah. What well, let think? me just be sure... To the, before we break, because I want you to gown up so we can do an examination. So the, these headaches really weren't there before you had this accident? Not at all. And then the accident happened, and you had some awareness that your neck wasn't quite supple and non-sore, as you right. said. But then three months, it's just been progressively getting worse, and the headache does get around both sides. It does get around both sides. And when it's bad, it does bother your vision and your concentration. and Correct. Stresses the devil out of you, it sounds like. Mm -hmm. And even interferes with your sleep some. Correct. 
but you hadn't lost weight or gone down in terms of your ability to function. No. Am I reading you? I, I, think, I think you're reading me. Mm -hmm. I think I could function better mm -hmm. if I didn't have these headaches. Mm -hmm. I, I think it's mm -hmm. a lot of effort to function well sure. with them. Sure, sure. Right. Uh, and the final thing is, with all the medications you take, do you know if you're having any side effects from any of those? Do you, know what, do you know what to look for? You know, not that I know of, and I, I wouldn't mm -hmm. know what to, mm -hmm. to look for, mm -hmm. but that was one of my concerns. It just seems like I'm taking so that much needs a lot. Yeah. that that just can't be healthy for me. Yeah. A couple of things just so I know, and, and, and you would learn something perhaps. 